Hey everybody, it's Jeremy, and I'm here with Zan again. We're back with the Zanesh, the Norska Slanesh uh, uh, Disciples game using Somber's Warhammer Fantasy mod. Uh, yeah, it's a uh, quick, quick recap. It's turn 79. Um, honestly, we're kind of uncontested at this point, truth be told. We're just marching armies through various, um, various nations and, and, and Zan's doing pet projects with a lot of empowerment. <laughs> so there's that, that stuff going on. So yeah, we're just going to jump back into it. How's it going, Zan? Hello. It is going well. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. We gotta, we gotta do that whole like period of reacclimation to figure out what, what did we just do and what are we trying <laughs> to do immediately. All oh, right, yeah. I did some streams from Hades, so I got some Kokithia running around. Hell yeah, cool. Awesome. I'm trying to combine an army. Oh, right. I remember. I lost, like, a hundred chosen to, like, seven gelatinous cubes. That right. was fun. Because they got uh, Moss Body and Wave Warriors and all that fun stuff. Or they have that enlarged. Yeah. It was great. It was uh, it was pretty fucking amazing, honestly. Like mm -hmm. I, even though it happened to me, I love seeing in Dominions whenever a really cool counter comes up to something, because so far nothing has been able to stand up to the chosen when they're all like battlefield buffed and everything like that. So and it was that very did a really very good cool. job. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's something we can take into multiplayer. Absolutely. I, well, I've started, I've started like really, I've started being way more interested in gelatinous cubes and vile water. Um, one, because I, I just realized I don't use water gems for a lot of other things, aside from a few like forging scenarios. Oh no. But yeah. Uh, you always gotta get some sort of, at, at least at, at, to me, the way I play is toward the late game, there has to be some expenditure of the gem. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, unless and, unless but, I'm planning like saving for some sort of global or like oh I know I'm gonna need like seven casts of murdering winter you know something like that. Mm -hmm. well, I mean that is a fair usage of it. I mean I remember murdering winter is once per province per turn though. But yeah, that is stockpiling for just nuking somebody is a hundred percent like a fair use of it. Ah. Keep, keep clicking incorrectly but for for water gems depending on what nation you are i will say because i i do this all the time never forget that water bottles are a legitimate usage of your water gems yeah that's fair because i always Absolutely. go like to the conjuration tree and i'm like all right what, what can i summon with this oh sure. nothing yeah <laughs> water bottles though Water bottles are pretty good. I'm also a huge, huge, huge fan of just having a shit ton of demon banes. Honestly. Yeah. Like that's demon also fair. banes having 15 fire resistance and some HP on them for for three water, assuming that you're using hammer, right? Is really good quality. Because in the late game, if you just have a demon bane on every major commander that you know you can, that doesn't already have other hand gear. You know, it's um, a way for everyone to not immediately die to flames from the sky. <laughs> yep. Uh, fucking flames from the sky. That's a spell. Very contentious. I I have big feelings about it right now because of of. The uh, recent ending of the uh, the tournament brackets, which I won't go into depth on, but I think we're at the point where uh, a lot of people are seeing what's like coming up. So I don't think it's like super spoilery, but I won't go super in depth. Um, but yeah, there's it's just it's very oppressive <laughs> to deal with. Mm -hmm. 
I'm definitely glad one of my favorite nations to play is Abyssia, where you just you are the one that casts right from the sky. <laughs> no one's casting that crap on you. That's a that's absolutely a good one. Yep. And all the mages that are not Abyssians running with your army, they already have some fire resistance gear. Not because of your enemy though. Yeah. <laughs> Very fair. All right. I think no wait i can't use that weapon because of this i think i'm ready i'm still uh uh reason through i'm setting i'm basically gonna do like a free turn here where i'm just basically setting everyone to kill so that next turn I'm, i'll be like oh that's what i wanted to do you know gotcha I think I want person. I need more ways to get the fuck around my territory faster. Yep, always have a, a horde of boots of the messenger, or depending on your territory. Uh, you might have to do the, the flying boots instead of those. Absolutely. Maybe one or two seven-mile strides. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. And it, I think in a pinch, uh, if you have quickness boots, those also give a little bit of map move. Yeah, actually, absolutely. Those are another really good use for water gems if you've got the, if you've got the right people to put them on. Um, okay, I think that is probably fine for now. Oh, right, I was actually also gonna, like... I was thinking about putting up a global or two. Alright, I'm done for now. Okay. Oh, it is rolling. Got by the lipo. She wants love. You're not providing it. All right. Got a couple of magic phases. Yeah. Wait, did this guy attack me? Oh, okay. Yeah, he was moving. Oh, boy. What's going on here? That's just rude. Woohoo! Prince of Damnation versus a Bane. Not a competition. Oh my. No gelatinous cubes this time, so things went significantly better. That's I say that, I still lost two sorcerers. <laughs> I think I burned them out, though. I keep I keep being very nonchalant about the size of my communions. I should probably yeah, get them some bows. Be. If I'm just going to be using them for, like, a divine blessing, I should, like, I should just give them a bow and make them shoot afterwards. Yo, that's a good one. Which one is this? This is Yama, the Keeper of Secrets. I'm gonna open up my wish tab. Your wish tab? Oh no. Yeah, I gotta make sure I write what I'm wishing for correctly, or else That's bad fair. things happen in the Dominion's universe. Very, very fair. God forbid you misspell your wish. Mm-hmm. 
I've never had that happen in a game, but I have had that happen to other people in games that I have been in. Honestly, I don't think I've played a nation that their late game revolves around Wish. In a multiplayer game, of course. I have not either. I've played I've yeah. played plenty of nations that could make use of good wishing in the late game, but not not individuals that were just like, yeah, we want to be wishing consistent. Yeah. Okay. And one right now where there's a, a big Pelagia, it's early age Pelagia, so you're like, yeah, who cares? And they're in the lake fighting Atlantis, I think. And it's just like, I really hope Atlantis wins, because if not, Bellagio is going to start wishing for crap, and you can't do anything about that. I think I'm on. I'm, yeah, I was still on the wrong turn. I was I was going to say, a lot of that stuff was, <laughs> it It does this weird thing where every once in a while we're like, you in, when I end a turn, I don't know if this happens for you, but when I end a turn, it'll take, it'll, it'll load, it'll process the new turn, and then it'll put me back on that old turn. And then I have to hit intern again to re-get the files. So. Oh, that sounds annoying. It was just like, I just didn't realize I was checking the previous, because it because honestly, it's been so long, right? So like I was like, oh, okay, what's going on here? Oh, oh. and then I, I opened the map and I was like, oh, this is the same turn I was just on, damn it. Yikes. You had started looking around already, too? Yeah. yeah. It's okay. We got Xan 2.0 doing his thing. Let's see how Ooh. it goes. Oh, it's just PD. You've got this. Easy win. Easy win. Let's see if I can piss Battle off the Plutonians and Islev. have them attack me. Oh, wait, no, because if I magic phase on top of my fort, it won't do anything. Also, hmm. hell yeah. Oh no, there's a cube! Oh, and it's moss bodied! They're so uh -oh. good at moss bodying the cubes! But it only has protection 10, so I don't think that's gonna matter. Yeah, it got gotten. Very scary. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, the Keeper of Secrets being just rolled out in mass now is kind of kind of too hard I think for the AI to deal with fine don't get I'm not complaining though because like <laughs> <laughs> like I've been getting Getting it handed to me, so it is very. It feels very good for me to be like, "Oh yeah, I got this now." <laughs> Send in the keepers. Right, yeah. that's what I was doing in the last session. Was just setting up all my armies to autopilot. In the direction of baddies. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Definitely working towards that scenario. I had someone was was gonna be my. I had a, I have my auto fog warriors now. Someone was gonna be my auto. Um, Bill of the Fates. Right. Oh no! I already have one of. Them. Oh. Yes. Oh, I have two over here. When in doubt, never forget that the crystal shield is a good item for autopiloting things. Absolutely. Very good. Shield is great. I don't have very good... I think only my god can make it. But I don't know... It's your only astral rift? Yeah. Oh, that's yep. unfortunate. It's real rough. I should probably empower just to get around, because I have plenty of astral. I just don't have any real earth... 
Yeah, I've got plenty of astral, but I'm doing dumb shit with it, so <laughs> can't help you too much. Very fair. All good. Don't want to get. Ooh, our dominion is pushing so hard now. Awesome. Okay. Definitely want. So we got our divine blessing. Make sure I pull the right people. As protection. Fog warriors. Will the fates. Got so much random stuff on me from these fights. <laughs> oh, just getting items? Yeah, just random items. I was double checking. I was like, am I seriously just waltzing around with wooden warriors? I mean, WTF? You've got the mages. <laughs> oh, this guy got protection for some reason. Full minded. To be fair, it looks like I am also walking around with mass protection instead of anything else. Once I get a crystal shield, I can do other stuff. I have a um, troll king that is going to be a part of my next set of... But I got to make some... Before I do... This whole, like, remembering what's going on is a bunch. Mm -hmm. That's why we gotta get these guys on autopilot. Okay. 
yeah when i do multiplayer games i have a nice notepad checklist kind of deal going on i have spreadsheets yeah. <laughs> where i'm just like here is what's happening hmm yes what did i do that last turn sense. That makes much more sense and would be much more organized if I did that. <laughs> I don't know. It depends on your spreadsheet. <laughs> Sometimes my spreadsheets, it's like you're creating more chaos than needs to happen right now. Uh. Okay. I need my other army to start. Who needs to be involved in that? Need to be involved in that, and need a. Uh, you need a cornucopia. Can't make. Have this now. You. I wanted. Ours need. Out trapeze here. Three stars. Three stars. Where's my brain? Stars. <laughs> one of you three air. One of you astral. Get the fuck over here. Also. that and that I need another and another cloak of astral And that'll be my fog warriors. That'll be my What big water thing was I trying to do in battle? Is that just gonna spam quickenings? It's probably just gonna spam quickening. Quickening's Sounds like pretty it. solid. I guess I could do like Evil Flames is pretty fucking dope. Evil Flame. Well, I can't currently, but I could go to war. You can certainly try. Right? Oh, that was almost bad. I'm making a communion and I forgot to script all the masters to start with communion master. Ooh. <laughs> Things could get dicey <laughs> on that. Yeah. In that regard. <laughs> Half my mage is just communion slave, and the other guys are like, "Good luck with that R fireball." <laughs> oh right, um, the Damon Prince. I need to get someone else out here. Um, yes, let's pull to our firing champion. Also go. Really so. Us. A little skull. Good. Okay. What other major thing do I need? Feel like I need to do? Right now, uh, really, I'm just trying to have some armies rolling to try to crush these last couple of alt dwarf locations. So I'm gonna put an army on two of their three fortresses right now and I'm putting armies on a lot of the Kislev stuff are we at war with Ulthwan? I don't think they've tried to mess with us yet so also 
Like How that. the fuck is Old One in that one little province right next to you? Like, uh, where? Uh, in Dothan, 139? How the fuck did they get there? They're very good at directions. <laughs> like, they're so lost. <laughs> what? <laughs> even happen i don't i don't know how to compute that honestly <laughs> a pd dump a little bit in these places so hopefully all uh all dwarf does not take them lee we'll see I'm just kind of getting tired of Altdorf backfilling through a couple of these places. Yeah, that gets annoying. The AI's infinite armies. Yeah. Okay, I think... It's not perfectly efficient, but I'm pretty sure I've done useful things here and there. <laughs> I've done the stuff! Wonderful! Oh, um... I need to be doing something with my god. Just not sure what... What was I talking about earlier? Oh, I could do a crystal shield. That would at least be good. Yeah, crystal shield with the god would be important. Uh, I know you wanted to empower some earth thing in astral. Yeah, I think probably take one of my astral threes and empower. I've got... Mm, I'm going to hold off on that because I want to get a... What's it called? A crucible of stone on my troll king so that he can yeah. do... Um, army of gold on auto yeah yeah that that's huge i'll probably have enough gems for by the nah i'll have plenty of gems for by the time i uh, get that that's fine i'll go if you need gems i probably can send you something nah i'm good i should be good for now all right all right i have hit yeah okay you already you're <laughs> already <too>. on <laughs> same timing <laughs> yeah what are you doing lipo Look like you're exploring around after something. You want a treat? Is it treat time? It can be treat time. Otis, treat. Lippo, treat. All right, Odie, buddy. Here is a treat, good sir. Nice. Lippo, would you like a treat? That's a long battle. That's a long battle. What the fuck is happening there? I bet it's one of us, but I don't know which one of us it is. Was I fighting something? I was fighting something with moss body assholes. Oh. So that might be me. And they were berserking, so yeah, they'll sit they'll stick around. They'll stay forever. <laughs> oh, was it me? Oh no, it wasn't. Okay. Ooh, Norska smashing some Itza. Whoa, why are there why did I lose so many shamans? Where was that? Uh oh. Oh no. Where was that? Oh yes, no, my perfect. communion. Oh, did your communion burn out? Oh no. I always forget. No, worse. I always forget how much faster things are underwater than on land. <laughs> are things say that? Are things faster underwater? Oh. Oh, huh? oh, yes, they are. Oh, no. See? Oh! Oh! Oh, God! Ah! <laughs> wow. Kululu's doing work. How very un unexpected. Well, that one I w was not the one I was expecting. <laughs> I, like, I, I wasn't prepared for that battle. That was a whoopsie. There's a lot of gems down the drain. Oh god, where even was that lake purple? Oh, how the hell did they get... Oh! Well, that is a very large Kislev army. And that is one Ragatok. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Perfect. If this happened to me in a multiplayer game, I would be pissed. Hey, 
In point of fact, I'm a little mad at myself every time I do it to someone else in a multiplayer game. <laughs> Like, cheese him with a super combatant yeah just some super combatant asshole that's like never gonna die I'm just gonna pretend I don't have any titan videos <laughs> teaching people how to all, do that all of the titan videos Zan stop it stop teaching people how to do this shit no it's great it's but great. It's fun. It's, uh, no, it's, it's a pretty super... good hard counter to the uh, uh, the current meta of imprisoned stats and crap. Yeah, I agree. Oh, well, like, the concept of, like, uh, uh, awakened titans or, like, dormant titans I think is really, really cool. I definitely appreciate that from the shakeup. I, I appreciate the super combatants in your army over less <laughs> but there are there are ways to counter it and people should be prepared to counter it in a game like this yeah. you know yeah i mean honestly I, again funny. not non spoilers but i had a recent ish scenario with that where i was like oh god oh god and then i went mm, i'm gonna do this and i fucked him up <laughs> and you know cuz if you're you have to you have to have more than one option. If your only if your only stick is oh this super combatant's real big and scary, if someone breaks that stick, then you're fucked. You know? Mm hmm. But it's it's very That's... good for buying time or having an un unexpected like drop on an army early in the game. You know. this point in the game though every uh every actual human player should have anti super combatant counters like pin gear with with like soul slays or disintegrates or you know the right types of like um two-handed weapons or things like that to actually deal significant damage right like you know midget masher combos or, or um, armor, penetration gear, that type of stuff. Yeah. It won't actually stop the shenanigans from happening, though. If well, it, it just yeah. makes it more difficult. Yeah, you can. Uh, that is very frustrating. I will say, you can still lose like a massive army because your your counter can't get into combat with the super combatant, <laughs> which is very frustrating. But you know, it is what it is. Mm -hmm. Well, I've I, I mentioned it's it up before. To the... Go ahead. Oh, uh, it, it's up to uh, the the thing with the doing it in the later game is you want to find or scout out the one army that doesn't have a counter to your super combatant. Yeah, and that's where you send it. Sure. And uh, like I said, though, like even if you even if you do, um, even if every army has a counter to your super super combatant, it's still not a guarantee that that counter is going to be successfully deployed like is it if you lose a 400 stack it, it, to kill this one super combatant is it worthwhile to lose the you know 30 mages in there and all the gear and blah 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 blah, blah and but you oh you killed that super combatant sometimes yes but sometimes no so like it depends on whether or not it actually is quote unquote successful Anyways, that was a pretty good turn for me. I've talked about this with you, I think, before. I really think there needs to be a mechanic in the game where, like, heroes or big creatures or things like that can, like, wade through the regular troops. Like, the regular troops will, like, make way for them. Yes. So that they can get into combat with big things or with, like, you know, other super combatants or things like that. Like, if you had... If there was, like, a checkbox that you could click on uh commanders to say like this commander will go like through um through units or something like that through allied units um that would be really really cool yeah trample without the damage sure like, friendly trample yep 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 <laughs> yeah that that 100 percent would be it, it would make it a lot more difficult to do the whole titan shenanigans because now the, the great yeah. sort of sharpest guy will make it to him sure but uh, I think it would be healthier for the game overall, yeah. I agree. And I, st I still think there would be a great timings and opportunities to employ super combatants like that. Yes. Right? For sure. Um, 
But uh, yeah, I think it's in a game of counters, you want to actually allow your counters to be real things. So, <laughs> you know. Okay. I'm going to try to debate the Bretonians and let's see if uh, they fall for it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, if they do with the full force of their army, then I get to steal a bunch of peasants. Would be pretty cool. Would be pretty cool. Uh, this guy gets this. I'm looking at the wrong people. I keep, I keep like, hmm, are we ready to do this thing? And I'm like, oh, nope, wrong person. <laughs> My brain. I'm doing the Zan thing and running around putting temples everywhere. We're just, like, we're That's just gonna dom kill the world, basically. That'd be pretty interesting. I mean, yeah, we're actually. Snaking up the map really quick now that you started really, pushing into Reichland. Really quickly, yeah. As soon as I think, as soon as Altdor falls, because they they had so many candles. Um, as soon as they fall in this area, we're just gonna start sprinting up. It's it's actually kind of intimidating. Uh, yeah, let me make sure I'm blood sacking everywhere I could be. I'm not blood sacking everywhere I could be. Um, but I am doing it in a lot of locations. Mm -hmm. I suppose. Realize I don't actually have a lot of big bloodcasters. Whoopsie. So these are going. And I need um M. I need like two, four, five, six people and take a. Do I need? Oh no. Oh, right. I was going to. I too. Right. Bodyguard. There's a command for, like, bodyguards, but I don't remember what it is. Someone pointed it out to me the other day in a video but it's been too long between me <laughs> reading that and actually trying to employ it so i do not remember what it was anyway. i kind of auto set people to bodyguards yeah 
Hmm. Okay. There's like a hotkey you can press or something like that as you're selecting like troops or something. So that, uh, I, I don't know. If you press uh, question mark or the shift question mark or whatever that makes up the menu. Let's see if anything different comes up. Hmm. I don't see anything obvious. Uh, G, guard commander. Oh, where? Ah, there it is. Battle orders, G. Okay, let's employ this. It's... So I guess you hover I'm over. going to take these and just be like, G. Hmm. You got a mouse over where it says set battle orders? G. Mm. Or not that one, Other the, the ones, one yeah, on the right. These ones. Ah, and then it auto, okay. It'll automatically there dish out the, the overflow. Interesting. Cool. Yeah. I guess that I mean if you're if you're doing like a select all put in G select all put in G select all put in G that's fa that's gonna be faster than like actually counting out the five each time so that's fair. <laughs> all right. That's protect. That's what it was. Because enchantment eight is mass for two. Okay. That's a goodie. next turn i can send out another army i was gonna send it now and i just realized i don't have a holy three in there to actually plus everyone i don't feel like oh. scripting it across the board very fair yeah that's a it's a pretty important one I mean, for us especially, <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh fuck! I gotta get, I gotta get another one of these. Um, yeah, they'll still berserk without the blessing, but they won't get all the other fun stuff like blood bond and awe of gotcha. resistances. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever cool stuff these next thrones are gonna have. Oh man, there's a throne of the Pantocrator in here. Holy shoot, I don't think I've seen that one. It's 
Spread Dominion 7, that Conflict one. Bonus plus 2. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, bro, yeah, where one's... is that? <laughs> that one's that big shit. Spread Dom 7. That's seven temples. Let me start, like, scrying around. <laughs> Uh, that should be like the last temple we have access to. Probably. Honestly. I hope not. Another. Who? Oh, oh, you're the person who does my staff of the O one god. Actually. And I need. What makes um is it water nature that makes clam of pearls? Mm -hmm. Yep, it's early construction too, so you might not see it if you're looking too low. I just had to find my water nature guys. I don't have a crazy large amount of them. Fair. Okay. All right. Uh, I am hitting in turn, and I'm gonna run you to the bathroom real quick. I'll be right back. Yeah. Sure thing. Right. Uh, this is secretly the part where my nation turns around and backstabs the Sun Horizon while he's listening in on his. Wireless headset. But he can do nothing about it. <laughs> right, I'm mostly excited if uh, Bretonia marches out to fight my dudes, but uh, it's going to get a nasty surprise. And ideally, I'll get a free army. We shall see. Fingers crossed for Zan's free army. Also, it would be absolutely terrifying to try to fight you right now. <laughs> like, That's you're easy. so freaking big. Easy peasy. Horrendous. Lemon squeezy. I love that the AI is just throwing large amounts of... Bamboozled. Yeah. <laughs> oh, did you get him? Oh, I got him. Ah. <laughs> Oh my goodness, look at the size of that fucking army. Completely bamboozled. Ooh, that time stop was timely. And... It goes... Oh, you got Team's Colored Squares on? I do. Oh boy. Ooh, ho, ho. that's a pretty damn good percentage. Oh Completely my god. Completely bamboozled. <laughs> I was supposed to vortex out, but I guess I stole too many. <laughs> it's like, nah, we'll stay and fight. It's all good. Holy crap. Rapola. Uh, so I got the green knight too. <laughs> mm. Yeah, a normal mage, you'd be like, oh no, the flyers are in the back hitting the mage. Not Ball and Stalin. No. Does not care. Holy crap. Very cool. Oh, and... Suddenly, you went from 2 to 152. <laughs> Woo. Damn. I want to see like, what other heroes or whatever. I guess those are just considered lords. Oh, the Green Knights? Uh -huh. Well, I the think... Green Knight, I know. Green that's the, that's like the primary hero. Yeah, that's a, yeah, that's a big deal. Yeah. Uh, but the other ones... Uh, I think the Paladins are heroes as well. Sure. Or not heroes are like recruitable. I'd have to look at the roster. Yeah. The Lord for sure, because I see tax collector. Yeah. 
My goodness. Welcome to the late game. <laughs> Very cool. Looks like I'm getting my butt kicked underwater, though. Oh, yeah? Yeah, Ooh. I took the Norskan Navy to land for some reason. And, uh, I think that was a mistake. They have decided to just come at thee. Where is the Norskan Navy? Oh, Lucid has it. That's not correct. He was running around trying to heal people. Oh, okay, okay. Let's get him back underwater. I'm getting my bucket down there. Thaumaturgy ritual. Hmm. Oh, right. This is why I guess I can put it. Blood sacrifice. Maybe I don't want to do uh, uh, temples over here, actually. This is kind of an unsafe place now. Here. All right. We this guy. Hmm. Uh-oh. That's an issue. This guy. I don't have the, the leadership to get these units out of here. Ooh. I guess I can set the important ones as like bodyguards. Fair, fair. Many. Fair. Definitely don't that to some rando and send him out. Tough in the time. Uh, what? Find break. Hit the tree staff. With a move find bracelet, I will also need another corner. I don't think I can do that with just any. I think I have to actually someone relatively bad. Okay, because a cornucopia is a mate. And I don't have those just floating around, unfortunately. Hmm, makes sense. Okay. Sucks is this wasn't the army that I was planning on doing stuff with. But now that I have all that Bretonian army stuck, it's like, wait, no, I have to go reinforce them. Oh, and the throne that's near us is the throne of misfortune, or near my other army. How unfortunate. Oh, but I see it. I see where the throne of the Panther Creator is. How can I get there? It's a long walk. I have that on. Um, that's not. We'll send. Ah, oh, there she is. Make it there without. 
No, she cannot. Self a new pair of boots. Okay. I'll send the army you're assigned to out to do that then. You're gonna go on a very long journey to claim the uh, throne of Pantocrator. Nice, very nice. Hundred fifty cancel here. need more armies honestly i probably just need a bunch of siege chaff truth be told well you got air magic right that's true that's i see some birds in your future very some true. great birds and great quantities hey. how's it going my okay oh you know what? That's actually a great idea. Mm -hmm. And first, though. Ah, ha, ha. All right. How many burbs can I get out of this guy? Mm -hmm. Five plus number... Every two levels right now. Okay, so we that's fine. Who the fuck's gonna fly them around? That's a question. Guess I could just make some boots. Just make some booties. Not intended to be doing any real fighting. They're just intended to. Crack some force. Hey. Eh. Oh, what's the stupid? Ah. Okay. Uh... There's a um. I need to start doing more um. Yes. Seeker packs. Seekers were pretty good. We could do some of those. Some 
going to worry about that later. So many units. So, so much stuff to do. Absolutely. Three hundred stack. That's close. These armies don't need to be invincible. They just need to be consistently good enough to, to crush the AI for me. <laughs> So that I can just march forward and plant more temples. Hmm. They're going to be invincible so you can't see them? I mean, that also works. So. Marching... Now that you're at war with Bretonia, it looks like you're actively marching on Athel Lauren. Uh, that army that's going to move to Athel Lauren is going to take a, a left and go down to the bottom of the map to then suddenly go to the top of the map. Oh, yeah. The throne, <laughs> the throne on the upper left there. That's, that's the, the throne, throne of the Pantocrator. Cool. Yeah. Very cool. And once we get that, uh, we will Domco the world at this rate. Absolutely. Tell me before you end, okay? Oh, um, on the verge of it. Let me make a couple but of I final adjustments for you. I'm just doing some additional blood sacking to to be part and parcel to the great uh, Dom killing. Uh... I have ended, you feel free to. Okay. I have also sent the button. Hell yeah. AI thinking. Not real. That's a very slow battle resolve. Uh, oh no. Okay, maybe the, the other large army came to mess with me. If you get another free large army, that would be pretty awesome. Yeah. Oh, dude, I forgot to send more pearls. So, yeah, this will be my last Master and Slave until Ooh. I capture the fort. Yoink. <laughs> Did you get him? Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, God. It's even worse than last time. Oh, my God. Last time was a pale comparison. Yoink. <laughs> oh, God. Time stop and... Yoink. So many battle pilgrims. Wait, why is Lucid's navy there? He's supposed to be underwater. Right? I, I saw that. I was like, hold up. Oops. <laughs> Whatever. Oh my goodness. 29 more battle pilgrims. Hell yeah. That's all that survived? Did I not yeah. catch that many in the fight? Got other stuff. Well, yeah, that's that's all that you got versus, I guess? Oh, uh -huh. oh well, yeah, you got a lot of pilgrims, but not battle pilgrims. Gotcha. Yeah. Got two battle reliquies. Oh, yeah. That's pretty cool. Oh yeah. oh yeah. Yeah, I think I only had enough pearls to do one master and slave, so 
I don't even know what he did for the second one. Hell yeah. Nice. There you go. They were secretly a chaos cult that had infiltrated the Bretonians. Just coming out at the right fucking time. That is brutal. Oh, Bretonia. Just charging into battle and being utterly betrayed. Uh -huh. <laughs> Horrendous. Alrighty, so what did I get here? Okay. Uh, did I get any cool mages? I got Ugh. Grail Lords, Grail Damsels. Uh, I already have the Green Knight. Cool. Very nice. Ow! I hate this place. There a uh oh. <laughs> the uh, negative side effect, holy crap, of stealing the entire Bretonian army, of stealing two Bretonian armies, is I, I I can't feed them anymore. Oh God! Yeah, yeah, I can I can imagine that might all be... of my mages. Or nature mages. <laughs> Might be an issue. <laughs> All of my mages are nature mages, and it's not enough. Oh boy. Are going there? Looking at the time, this will probably be the last turn for me. Okay. I'm... Can... Can be the... You can ferry around the Great Eagles. Wonderful. Holy hell yeah. It's a province? That's what? It's like a little cave. It is a little cave. It's not like a little cave. It is actively a cave. Castle. That's a lot of crap. <laughs> Blood sacrifice. I, think I don't even know how to organize this mess. It lags when I try to. I would imagine. <laughs> I would absolutely imagine. Alright. Y'all are just gonna get thrown into squads, and if you survive, maybe the Chaos Gods will smile upon you. Right? I'm being so just... Hell, Mel, nonchalant, like, guess you can go here. Guess this person can do this thing. I don't care. Mm. 
<clears throat> oh, shoot. Do I have... I think I do, right? Okay, I do. All my people are starving and uh, running out of hit points, so I think I might need a cast gift of health. Uh, that sounds like a decent idea. I don't want to do Vengeful Waters, because then we're not going to fight anything, but I don't know if I feel like doing uh, <laughs> Looming Hell, because it sounds fun. Oh, yeah? Sure. And it's capped at five commanders gotcha. for the global, I'm pretty sure. So it shouldn't be, like, oppressive. Oh, well, you know. Doubling the hit points of everything sounds interesting, though. I'm sure nothing could go wrong with that. Uh, yeah. 100%. Sounds great. What in the world actually I guess I don't care that much. Not that big of a deal. I mean this guy can leave. Or great eagles? I need one of uh, that's a that's just a straight astral one. I didn't realize that. Only totally make those very easy. I'll make a second one. In fact. Okay. I'm so behind the curve, but I just don't even care at this point because it's just March Army, March Army, March Army, March Army. Yep. I think I've got three of them that I can autopilot places. Well, two and a half because now this one is in mass starvation mode. <laughs> That's fair. I just got like Oopsie. a bunch of Kislev forts under siege by keepers that they, they just can't do anything against them. So I'm just going to bring a stack of eagles behind and be like, crack this fort, send the keeper in, on to the next. Crack this fort, send the keeper in, on to the next. Mm -hmm. That's kind of what I was doing in, I don't know if you remember in Bosmos when uh, I, that, that crusade against Ermor. Oh yeah? Nice. It was literally just sweep his armies with the chariots and in their wake would come the, the stacks of great eagles to pop the forts and then maybe like a secondary wave coming in from behind oh, of yeah. more chariots to clear it out but it was just the initial wave was just take like uh clean out the defenders and leave it under siege and then move on <laughs> leave like one or two units to have it under siege and just keep going Chariot train had no brakes. Uh, what? My gear set. Oh. Where do you have a pair of boots? Oh, he can't use a pair of boots. Helmet? Oh, he can wear an actual helmet, unlike the keepers. 
gets a uh, fucking dragon helm. Oh yeah. Actually, unaltered. I am. Uh, hidden. Sit down and see what breaks on the stern then. Alrighty. Boltorf is so close to dead. They're so close to dead. <laughs> I'm putting I'm putting a big army on their capital. I'm taking like their second to last fort. I don't know actually. The the ogres have been sieging one of their forts for a very long time. I haven't been paying attention whether or not they took it yet though. If they don't take it, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to push them off of it and take it myself. Yeah, kick those, kick their butts. Okie dokie. Oh, Gift of Health is going to be so, so crazy with how much freaking Dominion we have. My goodness. Infinite health. Basically. Hmm. Wait, what? How did I fail to capture the fortress? Did Vortex and Returning finally script out? Is oh, that what happened? Did it? Is that what happened? Son of a... Is it? Is that what yes. actually happened? Oh, no. Yes. God. Oh, fuck. Dang it. Now that whole army is just... Oh, fucking gone. <laughs> oh, that's what I get for lazy scripting. God. Oh, jeez. Which one was that? Uh, Grey Mountains? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Jesus, it's a huge stack, too. Oh, no. No, time stop, no! Dang it. <laughs> That's all I can say. <laughs> There's three of them left. Oh no. Oh, oh, those three, those three freaking two Pegasus Lords and one Bretonian noble Pegasus is they're just like, what the fuck just happened? <laughs> <laughs> what? What the fuck? fuck just happened they were all ready to die prepared the lightning bolts were in the skies <laughs> and then oh. and then an entire norskin army just fucking disappeared that's like something you would actually read in a warhammer novel right mm -hmm. like oh fuck well if you've ever played a chaos campaign or norska in warhammer Beyond your comprehension. <laughs> yep. Absolutely. Gosh dang it. The ways of chaos are fickle. Oh, this little, this misfortune is tearing me up. Oh my goodness. Ooh, upcoming arena battle. Yo. Okay, I've got a. Oh I've got to send Mitch's going in. I've got to remember I'm doing it right now so that I do not forget. Sending in Mitch. Not the best setup in the world, but yeah. would it be? All right. 
So I took that one, I took that one, I suffered there, and then whatever. At least get, Gift of Health is going to make everyone feel better. Except me, because I know what just happened. <laughs> fair. <laughs> That's fair. Very fair. All right, but yeah, so I'm going to, I'm good to leave it here. Okay, well, very, very cool. Um, We, oh, it's so heartbreaking. Yeah. Altdorf has their capital, two provinces, and then the fucking place that the ogres have been sitting on for like 20 turns now. So that's happening next session. I am fucking killing Altdorf. They are, <laughs> they are dun, dunzos. Um, but my god, uh, our, our dominion is going wild, my dude. We honestly might just dom kill and like... It's turned 84 right now. Do you think we could... With the with the rate that it's been moving, do you think we could dom kill before turn 100? Hey, if we get the throne of the Pantocrator and keep going at the rate we are, maybe. I think it's... I think that's a laudable goal. Um, That would be pretty wild. All right, anyways... Uh, that was a lot of fun. That's going to be the end of this video. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye, everyone. Hey, everybody. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider leaving a like, commenting, or subscribing. It really helps me out. If you'd like to see me live, head over to my Twitch at twitch.tv forward slash the distant horizon.